Hello, we are discussing about gate 1994 EC paper and the topic we are discussing is electronic devices. This is fourth one more question came in 1994. The transit time of the current carriers through the channel of an FET decides its dash characteristics. The transit time of the current carriers. Current carriers is nothing but which carries the current. That is nothing but simply charge carriers only. That is electrons or holes. The current carriers. Transit time of current carriers through the channel of an FET decides its dash characteristics. The answer for this one is switching characteristics. So transit time of current carriers through the channel of FET decides its switching characteristics. First of all, we see what is meant by this transit time and how can it relate to the switching characteristics. Transit time is the time required for a charge carrier to cross the channel region that is from source to drain. So how much time does it require for a charge carrier to move from source region to drain region is called as transit time. The region between source and drain is normally called as channel region. So transit time is the time required for a charge carrier to cross the channel region which is from the source to drain. If we are assuming that one n channel MOSFET by that time this is n channel MOSFET and whenever a channel is going to be formed between source and drain this block shade implies nothing but the channel is existing. So this is a channel length L. Look at this one. This is a channel length L which is starting from source end to ending at drain end. So the region between source and drain is called as channel whose length is L and it is starting from x is equal to 0 and it is ending at x is equal to L. It is n channel it always fabricates under p type substrate. Okay. And transit time is now defined as the time required for a charge carrier to cross the junction that is to move from the source to drain region. So this is the name for this terminal is source. The name source is given such that it is sourcing the majority charge carriers for the MOSFET. MOSFET is a unipolar device whose current conduction is only depends on one type of charge carriers that one type is always majority carriers and this source always sources that majority carriers since it is n channel it sources electrons so electrons will move from source to drain side so how much time does it requires for the electrons to move from source end at x is equal to 0 to reach drain end at x is equal to L that is going to be treated as transit time. How fast the electrons are moving from source end to drain end that indicates how fast the device is going to be turning on as well as turning off. So the switching characteristics that is nothing but on off conditions are going to be based on the movement of charge carriers. If they fast move fastly at that time it turns on switch quickly. In so we can say that one uh, transit time is going to be directly decides the switching characteristics. So the right option for this question is switching characteristics. Transit time of charge carriers decides switching characteristics.